Let's take cooking class. We are going to have Thanksgiving dinner today with G is going to help me. And we are going to have wonderful turkey. It's a little bit in, inspired by Mediterranean ingredients. And I hope you are going to like that too. And let's cook turkey together and happy Thanksgiving to you all. Happy Thanksgiving. We have all the ingredients on the table. And of course, it's like a Mediterranean breeze is going to be in this uh, turkey dish. And a lot of stuff since, you know, we are practicing more Mediterranean cuisine. And we are going to have good uh, ingredients. Let's see what we are going to have. I have two grated onions. I have two sticks of butter. Two generous tablespoons of basil paste. Uh, two stems of celery that's grated and the rest of a bunch of celery are chopped for the filling. I grated the outside of the lemon zest for two lemons and uh, very generous, maybe two generous tablespoons of pepper paste and two cloves of garlic, a cup of olive oil and three medium sized potatoes for the stuffing. squeeze the juice and we will use the juice only. So you squeeze as much as possible. I squeeze the onion and I have onion juice. I'm saving the squeezed onion for another dish and we are going to make a marinade now. We are going to make marinade. I'm going to put the butter in the onion juice and put the basil paste and mix it. Also add lemon zest and celery, chopped celery, not chopped, grated celery and pepper paste. garlic and olive oil and I squeeze everything well and mix it well. Now it's time for turkey and we have turkey here and it's around like uh, 19 pounds of the turkey we have and as we say three potatoes and some celery I am going to mix together and I will add also some seasoning later on and thank you for uh, putting all this thing together we already have ready for the uh, filling and marinating we have butter and all herbs everything is inside it's ready now time for tying my turkey now it's time for some seasoning, of course, and we have some salt for inside of the filling and I have also for butter and I have crushed pepper, Aleppo pepper, I, I do half and a half and, and everything is like one teaspoon, generous one, and I have the same thing for cumin, I ate cumin and black pepper for each one in and out and final things is gonna be paprika half is in here and half over there and I am gonna mix them all well like that seems like all celeries are ready and also my butter spread for skin and Outside is gonna be ready. It's the best if you can wait. You can keep your turkey as in vinegar overnight 
and it's going to be all the uh, bloody part is going to come up and it's going to be more delicious. degrees or three hours first if it's cooked and I continue more and now it seems ready. Mm -hmm. 